Peace and bliss. Welcome back to Reclaiming Our Roots. My name is Tanya and we are at the farm today. We are starting our fall planting and I just wanted to bring you all along and show you all a new method that I'm trying this fall. It's called the square foot planting and what that is is you're planting your seeds in a square foot and it depends on what you're planting will indicate the spacing in the square. So take for example my daughter she's going to be planting some pole beans some Kentucky blue can you see Kentucky blue beans they're pole beans and there's a planting chart that comes with this kit and you look on the chart and you find bush pole beans as you can see it's the first one and it has to be placed and the seed has to be placed in a yellow square so you find the yellow squares circles on the square and you're going to plant it one each one inch in depth because that's what the seed recommendations require and that's what she's going to do so you want to get started sweetie give them a demo and show them how it works so she's going to Plant the seed one inch, turn it where they can see the marking on the stick. There we go. And she's going to go one inch in depth and she's going to plant, I'm sorry, she's going to insert the stylus into the yellow holes according to the planting guide. And according to the planting guide, we should be able to yield nine plants in this square. So essentially what this method does, it maximizes your growing in a limited amount of space, in a square foot. So you get more for less, which is a great method. I've seen a lot of my homesteaders use this method, a lot of gardeners, uh, like in their square foot um, raised beds, they use the square foot method. So I'm going to try it in in ground and see how it works. So she's going to place it over gonna do another square and she's firmly placing it down in the dirt the soil so she can get a good footing on it and she's gonna repeat the process she's gonna go one inch in the yellow holes because that's what's required for planting pole bush beans I'm sorry pole beans I really like this like I said you're it will afford you the opportunity to have more food in a square foot. If I'd have known about this years ago, <laughs> I really, I would have maximized our growing, our yields. Okay, and lift up the template for me, sweetie. And you can see the seeds in the hole. So that's nine plants. So we have a total of one, two, three, four, five. So that's a total of 45 plants in just this little bit of space. We have five squares with nine holes in each. Isn't that amazing? So I just want to bring you all along and you all can see we are planting away. I planted some transplant cabbages over here, red cabbages. Been busy bee this season, so some of them I sold, but they didn't turn out so well. So I opted for transplants. Okay, I'm not going to keep you all too long. Just want to show you what I'm doing on this beautiful, sunny Friday. Until the next video, peace and bliss.